I'm going to try to make a quick ASMR video. I haven't really felt the greatest, and as you know, I stated that I'd been sick for quite a while, and then I got a little better yesterday and feel bad again today, but I just also wanted to state that to those who had uh, two individuals who donated, thank you very much. It helps out. I was able to use that. I was trying to save it, and then I used $20 to put in the tank, in the fuel in the tank, in the truck, so that helps out more than you can ever imagine. Um, we go through our ups and downs, but I uh, want to also I want to state that my PayPal is below if you would like to help us through some tough times and just like to donate to donate to me as well. It goes it can go it can be transferred directly over to my mama's debit card and help us out and we can uh, use it for whatever we need. So to those that like to donate would like to donate thank you so much to those that have to the two individuals that have I know ASMR or love gave a, a very nice and generous $25 donation last time and uh, I appreciate that greatly and I also appreciate all of the new subscribers I decided I'm out in the truck right now decided to make a quick uh, quick audio we're uh, we had to get a few things um, we had to get these, uh, these things from the GNC place for my mama. The GNC, it's uh, the health place because it helps with her kidney problems. She has really bad problems. And this uh, kidney detox stuff really helps her. I hate that they're so expensive, but it really helps her. And uh, so I decided to make a quick video while we were out here and just not only do some tapping but just talk about talk about my PayPal and some other things and how uh, how it is also linked with it now so we can use it as needed and the donations really help out and all the new subscribers I want to say how thankful I am for all the new subscribers I think I'm I'm finally up to 93 and maybe someday I'll show my face in a video Maybe I'll wear some sunglasses or something and show my face in a future video and uh, I'll, uh, I'll wear these sunglasses or something It'd be kind of mysterious like. I'm trying to see right now if this is actually recording. I hope it's actually recording because if it's not, that's not good. Okay. I want to get back into making some actual physical videos. Well, not a physical video, but a visual video. You know what I mean. Several things. Right, um, a few days ago, I couldn't. I wasn't recognized on any of my any of my accounts, and uh, it was like chaotic. I couldn't. I wasn't recognized on Google. I wasn't logged in on uh, AOL. I couldn't get logged into PayPal. I couldn't get logged into um, eBay or anything. It was, or Amazon. Nothing recognized me, which I hadn't bought anything on Amazon in a while. I had to use the I used the the uh, some donated money from that I was kindly given to pay for this other phone that hopefully will work out. It's the same phone. It's a cheap. It's an older phone. It's S5. So the uh, let's see what was I going to say? The um, we had the oil change done and then they charged. It was like. Eighty dollars. I was like, "Whoa!" And they told me, "Oh, it's one system. My number, my mama's number. They couldn't find the email. They couldn't find all this, so I, I couldn't get the twenty dollars off." And 
so... Because I couldn't get that $20 off, it was like $80. And, uh, but it still winds up leaking, so we're gonna have to have that repaired someday, but... That's life. That's how it goes. Crazy, crazy things. But there was a sunny day this week. That's a plus. There was a sunny day this week. It was, uh, and I did get the yard mowed again. And um, I did get that done and a few things done. Could not get the weed eater started this time. It's been starting like clockwork, weed eater and the leaf blower. They've been starting like clockwork, but then all of a sudden now, it was either one or the other didn't want to start last week and or last month, and then now it seemed like now the weed eater doesn't want to start, and it's I'm like really why? But I guess that happens eventually. But other than that, I did get yard work done. I did what I could. been going through this kind of a, you know, it's the same old, same thing where you go through the ups and downs, the darkness, depression, anxiety, and things, and uh, you get that, and you know how that is, everyone, everyone gets their ups and downs, but, um, there was, uh, let's see, there was something good that actually happened, let's see, what was it? Oh yeah, my daddy found this stuff that seems to be helping him. Um, some of them are, you know, those things for uh, blood pressure and things are kind of expensive, but they seem to help. So that's what that's what's important is that they actually help. And that's the good thing. That's the good news. And um, it was this. Uh, there's one thing that tastes, tastes really bad. He said it tastes really bad, but it works. And this other stuff helps him as well, so... Um... So that's good news. That is good news. Anything that helps is always good news. Um... Let's see, what else was there? I'm trying to talk. Oh, excuse me. I'm still sleepy. I'm trying to talk slowly and uh, just kind of talk calmly. But I wanted to thank you for all the subscribers, all the new subscribers. That's greatly appreciated. Um, it means a lot. And I love you all so much. The cat, when we were uh, one of the cats, the outside cats, we have a calico named Cookie, and there's an orange tabby cat named Simba. He's kind of a, he's just a he's a big old lovable cat. But he, uh, let's see, I call him Simba, and then there is the indoor cat. She's she's been really nice lately. She's been nice lately. She's been moody in the past, but she's been nicer lately. And. Uh, Cookie didn't want us to leave earlier. She was like, she got right up to the, uh, she got right up to the spot where we were parked, where we where we were sitting, or where we were parked in the driveway, and she just kind of sat there and watched us leave. And a lot of times when I'll back the truck up and move the vehicles when I'm going to mow the yard or something, and I'll move things, she'll be she'll be moving, she'll be looking like you're going to stop right here, right? You're going to stop right here. And she likes to hang out with the dogs as well. She loves the dogs. Even though they're a red bone coon hound, blot hound, and English coon hound, they, 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 the cat loves, the cat, that cat loves them. And they're really good with cats, those dogs are. Of course, unless you get near their food when they're trying to eat food, but that's, that's a whole other thing. They're like, uh-uh, they're like, no. They'll push them away, but it could be a whole lot worse. They're very friendly with the cats. We just suddenly got those dogs one year. I think it was 2014. And five years we've had them because these people, 
they were across the road while we were mowing the yard and they just let the dogs off and this this they they were in this truck a pickup truck and they just they let the truck they let the dogs off and they just let them out of there and they kept one and they had had these children in there it looked like and they just told the dogs bye they backed up and they left and I'm thinking really they're just going to leave them right there at a major intersection and the dogs just red the red bone coon hound he was looking at them like he looked like I'm the leader I'm the leader it was a little old cricket bug <laughs> that's the, the Aristocats reference I'm the leader I'll tell you what it was it was a little old cricket bug anyway you know they they were right across the road and they and red acted like the leader the red bone coon hound acted like the leader and he uh, he led he looked both ways I'll never forget it my mama won't either he looked both ways when he was about to cross when they were about to cross the road and he he okayed them to go across the road with him and he led them he led all of the dogs across the road and they they went right for us right for us and then it took me a while to get the plot hound it took me a while to get the the third dog to uh, come to comply she was very nervous she acted like she had been beaten or and hit but yeah she uh eventually she just she complied in the pen and then all of a sudden now we have three dogs and it's we've had them for five years they've been really good <sighs> red though he can kind of get into trouble and he likes to get loose a lot and get out and he always did and he would always get tangled up if he was tired it was just it was just he would always get into things and he was just he was kind of a he was a little bit of a mess, but there was nothing much. There was not much we could do about that. And uh, eventually, he, uh, they all just, uh, I mean, they're just, they were all so, they adapted to us right away, immediately. And they've been good dogs. They have been good dogs. And we suddenly got this cat at Christmas. Daddy was, Daddy got this cat from Missouri, or can't yeah Kansas City, Missouri, and uh, we brought her home. She was very hateful and moody for a while, and then she's adapted. She seems like she's adapted and gotten slightly better. She's gotten better, and uh, now I mean she's a really good mouser, and that's the good thing. That is the thing about her that's been the blessing. She's kept mice away. She's hunted mice and then she wants me to take care of them. It's like, like here, I've gotten the mouse. I want you to get rid of it now, dispose of it. So I will, I'll dispose of it. And yeah, anyway, I don't like to kill anything. Mm -hmm. I know it's stupid when it comes to that, but I don't like mice and snakes and spiders, but still, um, I always capture them and get rid of them, get rid of them. But she's done a good job mousing. But anyway, that's all for this video, and that's all for right now. I just thought I would talk and give a little bit of an update on some things. And uh, so, peace, love, and many blessings. And as always, sweet dreams. And uh, I, hope, I hope this video was relaxing. I let my nails grow out a bit so I can have some tapping nails. Like this. So I hope it's relaxing. Maybe I should have used another thing. Another wireless charger. Anyway, peace, love, and many blessings. And as always, sweet dreams. My PayPal is below if you'd like to help us out. And if you'd like to donate and you like my content, feel free to like and subscribe, share, and all that good stuff. And to those that have, thank you so much. To those that have subscribed, to my new subscribers, thank you for helping grow my, for helping grow my ASMR channel. And 
feel free to donate and help us out. Peace. Much love. Bye.